Care, our vision revolves around disruptive innovation. Innovation is in our DNA, in the culture and the heritage at Sig Sauer. We're not here merely to innovate, but we're here to challenge the status quo. It begins with better designs, questioning everything, with no preconceived notion of what is possible. Take the ASP-20, our newest break barrel rifle. It's the world's first collaborative effort between the finest air gun engineers and the finest firearm engineers in the world. Hey, JB here, Fort Smith, Arkansas. Got a uh, target set down, downrange. 150 yards and there's an air gun depot golf ball sitting down there on top of a tin can that's on top of a bucket. 150 yards we've got a Walther LGU varmint here. A fairly new gun. Maybe. These things lose a lot of energy at 150 out of a Springer. Whisper Fusion Pro 22 caliber. Gamo introduces the newest addition to the Whisper Fusion family, the 22 pellet caliber Whisper Fusion Pro. Utilizing Gamo's patent pending, double integrated noise dampening technology, the 22 caliber version is more quiet than the older Whisper versions and delivers more knockdown power from the 33 cylinder, shooting 1,000 feet per second with PBA Platinum 22 pellets. The air rifle includes an all-weather black stock with rubberized grips, ergonomic design, the SAT, smooth action trigger, and SWA, the shockwave absorbing recoil pad that absorbs up to 74% more recoil pressure. Gamo taps off the 22 caliber Whisper Fusion Pro with a 3 9 x 40 adjustable objective scope, delivering excellent performance for hunting and target shooting at short and long distances. Hey everybody, I'm David with Umarex and I'm out today with a Walther air gun. This is the Terrace. Now, there are a lot of spring guns out there on the market. 
but this is one of the nicer ones. The terrace is made by Walther in Germany, so it has a level of craftsmanship that you wouldn't typically associate with your spring action air guns. There's a brake action, loads very simply. They make it 177 and a 22. The safety automatically engages whenever you cock the barrel down. It has fixed sights on the front. It also has an adjustable rear sight, which is adjustable both for elevation and for windage, and you can really dial it in super fine. Now both of the sights are on the barrel, which means you're not going to get any deviation in accuracy from moving it down and, and back into position. And this gun is also threaded at the muzzle, so if you actually wanted to attach a real live silencer onto the end, you could. Now, a lot of the Umarex guns come with the silencer technology, which is the, the attachment that's built onto the end. This one allows you to put the silencer of your choice on there, so long as you have the paperwork that clears it. This is the 22 caliber version. It's running right about 800 feet per second. It's got about 14 and a little over length pull inches on the length of pull. And the cheek piece down here, pretty modest. The whole gun weighs in a little over seven pounds. It's very light, it's light enough to carry. This is perfect for plinking. A 22 caliber pellet traveling over 800 feet per second, that's reasonably good and it actually has some stopping power if you wanted to hunt with it. But it's ideal for taking out in the field and shooting around. Everything about this gun feels good. From the way in which the cheek piece is molded and the grip, the texture patterns that they have here right around the palm swell of the fore end and on the grip itself, all of it feels really very intentional, which is not something that I would say for all of the air guns that I review. This is the Benjamin Trail NP XL Brake Barrel Air Rifle. It's available in 177 caliber, 22, and 25. All feature a wood stock with a thumb hole grip and a ventilated rubber butt pad. And they have a Picatinny rail for mounting your favorite optic. And they come with a center point 3 9 by 40 AO scope with mounts. These guns do have sling mounts, and they're all powered by the Nitro Piston Power Plant. This is a nitrogen-filled gas ram instead of a traditional coiled steel spring, and it delivers 70% less noise over the shot cycle than the leading competitor's brake barrel rifle. And it also has less vibration and an easier cocking stroke. To operate the gun, you simply tap on the end of it to break it open, swing it down, insert a pellet, close it up, and you're ready to go. There's a lever safety and located in front of the trigger. Flip it forward and you're hot. And it's a single shot gun. These guns are great for small game and medium sized game, including turkey and coyotes. So go beyond the backyard with the Benjamin Trail NPXL.